Uh, and if you don't hit that timing perfectly, it's kind of annoying. I think the one of the other things as well is very impactful in the lane. He's going to have presence. He's going to be able to get what he wants. Doesn't get hit by the scatter blast. Oh. Deleted. They got him. Yeah. Okay, like, Why didn't they sick the Enchantress lane? here? Because I then put the snap fire top with the, the PL. Yeah. Then your PL would get ruffled. So. Right, but you... Your PL wouldn't have a game. But you... I mean, they're not having a game right here. You purge off the Frost Shield, you purge off the Jingu. Like... The, they need to plug the hole at some point. Right. Oh, well, Fly Solo. Gonna drop there. So they find the kill. Carl with a K. And that could just be the whole brand, right? Just... Oh, That's a good Carl one. with a K. Yeah. Well, Fly Solo's dead again. Uh, and Tihi is getting zoned out. Game Dude, is game hard. Is so destructive top, like... And this is going to be continued survivability here. Three points up in that reactive oh, armor means he does not collapsing. need to leave. Chasen gets the kill. We'll even find the deny afterwards the on the Trinity catapult. And the Courier is meeting middle as well. Oh, what perfect timing. Really well done. Really, really well done. Just couldn't time it better. He's one of these guys pro players. Is he dead? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, he looks pretty dead. That one's no. a tough one. Oh, well, not when you miss your your chakra. The chakra. little jukey juke. And now the slowdown coming. Fly solo, chase cookie not on the mark. White Mon able to get the walk away and the final finish there onto JG. So with that rotation that you get from the couple of supports, Geek Fam find the kill. And these heroes that are supposed to be the big like tempo setters are not gonna do it. Carl also gonna find the kill onto Lucify. They don't have level six on Kunkka. Will's it way down mid. Watch out, this town's gonna fall. Looking for the clap, giving it to him. Zephyr needing to run. He's still living though, fine and dandy, and they will be able to pick up this outpost oh, for the moment. They're gonna get Zephyr. their first kill of the game, and it will be the Nyx. Now the only question is, can he escape? Oh, they glyph it. They glyph oh, the wave. No. Run Kunkka away, body. KG. The torrent not gonna hit onto anybody. They give him the tip afterwards. Carl's oh, like, look, look at Chad Carl, Alpha Carl. Just you didn't kill my catapult. You killed yourself. Uh, easy that's peasy. The, that's the that's the analysis you're getting there, by the way. I like it. Perfect. <laughs> Tree's dead. Oh, Mortimer kisses buddy. down, and he gets oh. away. Just like that, he's out of there. Spike Carapus to interrupt it, trying to get the kill with the impetus shots, but. Fly Solo just going to be broken and now going to be pummeled down dead. Oh, Another round because they don't have any trees there to spear onto. Sam H gets pulled back in. Carl is there, has the Chakram, has the Whirling Death. They want to find a kill. It ain't going to happen, man. Just call it done. Don't worry. The catapult's still alive. Unreal. Keep the catapult alive. Keep the catapult alive. My goodness. This is what they need. Like, this Timbersaw pick... There is no counter to it, and this is what happens when you can't put anyone into this lane. You will freely take every tower. Like, look at this map right now. You said earlier this was where they were playing on Dyer. Now look where they're playing. Yeah, ain't great. Uh, they are gonna get caught here. Carl gonna be pulled back in. The boat's gonna land. He has stick charges afterwards, and Cookie. Everything. It's it's yeah, just not looking like enough. It's not looking well, like enough. Kill the catapult to another lane. I feel like he's kind of done his work mid and he can't actually pressure high ground in any way, especially with the fact that the catapults are quite easily dying with the Kunga. Oh so no. Bottom. Oh no, play solo. Oh. They pull back in, try and get the finish T. He barely able to escape. Five thousand gold lead now, and as we get to the twelve minute mark, net worth all inhabited on the top by Geek Famine. This, in case anybody was wondering, is the reason why we're anticipating it's going to be a three-way tie for the bottom of Group B, because Geek Fam and Fnatic just feel like they're on that next level. And as Carl continues his reign of terror, trying to get towards the Yule Scepter next, which at that point, it's just so hard to make anything happen. You can outplay the X, you can use the Yule Scepter while going for the jump away. Aether Remnant, oh, not going to back to there. Missing the, yeah, missing the Remnants. All chilling, and now they're gonna get ran at. Gotta be careful, Cuckoo. He's crazy. He's running in there. He wants to kill off Sam H. Sam H doesn't have anything to handle that. And now Raven follows up afterwards on to fly solo. The impale comes through, finds another tree, eats him up. Filthy. 
And it is. Oh no! Oh, he broke the trees though. Timbersaw can't cookie. go after him. I don't eat the cookie. Eat the cookie. I'm okay. And Tihi, eventually going to die as well. Now He's where are they going to no push? More. Yeah. Now they do have a spirit vessel done on Kunkka, so if they could get a charge here, this would be really good for them. But unfortunately, they're all going to die. As the cookie, okay, the cookie, maybe a chance. There's going to be a spear though on a void spirit. So they do lose one. They lose one. Can they find any more? Well, they got Raven here what also. And pull them back the... in, in trouble and going down. So like I said, Spirit Vessel charges there for JG. Yeah. It, it gets a little bit harder. Um, there is oh, a Yule Scepter the for ping? Carl. Did Timbersaw ping? He's like, he just pinged tier three and was like, I said push bottom. That's <laughs> literally what just happened in their comms. <laughs> <laughs> They're falling apart. That's true. They can't handle it. They Unbelievable. The pressure. It's yeah, it's much too much. As the stomp comes out, Fly Soul actually keeps himself alive right there. That might be enough to let him out. Look, Carl stow it. He's now missing the shackles. They do have another stomp available here. Carl needs to be a little bit careful. They have the spirit vessel charge on him. He has a Yule Scepter to take it off afterwards, but do they have the extra damage? With that hood, it's not quite looking like it. And yeah, Sam H now realizing, okay, I don't have my arena. I can't really do this. He is just going to die instead. Hold it down. And on the other side, oh, Teehee also dead. Oh, what a dead. courier kill. Unreal. Mm. A chance, Teehee. They're going to cliff the way. Oh, God. All he wants is to deny his tower. Please don't take it from me. Teehee running. Zephyr's oh, there. See you later, my man. It, it ain't going to happen. Oh, doppelganger chase forward. Okay, okay they got okay, a boat. Okay. They got a boat. I don't know if that boat's going to be good enough, though. Cookie go through the other it's side, and land. in the meantime, so Void Spirit. Oh, he's got so much regen, so much living with that round. It comes through, and my man is not going to get any more Mortimer's Kisses thrown out. Zephyr walks out of the arena. Carl, maybe in a little bit of a bind, as he doesn't have that many stacks up of his, well... Maybe a chance for a turnaround there. Sam H is actually just going to die. Never mind. Geek Fam, we're running through him. Oh, Safai yeah, wants yeah. to run. The sad part of being a strength hero is that Timbersaw is pretty good against you as they blow him up again. <laughs> Jesus Christ, the voice lines. A baby? Because he's like way smaller than Snapfire. You yeah, know what but, I mean? Yeah, but isn't... Yeah, I guess she's also, pretty Timothy small too. A person inside it, right? So. I guess she's pretty small also. Ah. Look at her. She's tiny. You know what else is small? The chances of Loki winning this game. You're not wrong, as they just lose the freaking Phantom Lancer. Like, <laughs> Carl is completely alone. There's nobody yep. here. And he is yep. just punching the tier 3 towers. And they are trying their best to keep it off, but he is taking down the tower 29 damage at a time. <laughs> oh, look at the damage. Let's go. Here. You're not tripping. Not in the least bit. Not at all. But they're going to take down Roche instead. Oh, okay. Carl, Carl's going to give up in the mid lane. He's going to come and help participate in the Roche attempt. Okay. He can tank through it while everybody else punches it. So, 20 minute mark, they're gonna try and sneak this outpost. Moving in, Sam H wants to get it. I think he's in time? I'm pretty sure, definitely with Snapfire, they're gonna be able to get there. Uh. Lich? Hello? Is he fine? He's a level, look at all. No, he's not. He's, he's very dead. Zephyr, Cuckoo, wanna take them both down? Giving him the net, giving him the chase down. Timbersaw shows up. See you later! The Ancients even getting in on the action as they will find the taunt, will find the Whirling Death, and he, along with the rest of everybody that came and deemed to try and stop the pressure and take away the outpost, are all going to be in the grave. Like, the defuse actually does ruin Monkey, Timber, and Void Spirit, so there could be a very slight turning point. You play off the Vessel, you play off the Diffusal Blade, you hug your base, you can overturn this aggression, but... Why are you lying to our audience? 
Why, why would you do this? <laughs> why, why, why are you not providing both sides of the story, huh? Why are you giving them just what you want them to hear, huh? Well, I'm trying to give them the truth. You gotta be well, realistic. It, that's your version of the truth, though. That's true. Tell your truth, Mr. T. Governor. I just did. Let them know. <laughs> Another round of it is... Oh. Alright, it's over. They're not getting okay, they're not getting the diffusal blade, alright? Maybe I, I there's a hope. chance. <laughs> People need hope in society, okay? It's what makes the world go around. This one is looking real rough. Jump forward, looking for fast level possibly. A buyback. Raven? Ooh, they cookie the creep. Okay. Yule Scepter lift up. A little bit of Mortimer's cookies going out there as well. Kisses rather than cookies, as Fly Solo gets one last punch into the face from Raven and he's dead. There's a lot of bouncing going on. Whether it's a cookie or whether it's a Monkey King feeling himself, Carl is going to hold on and just keep this pressure on constantly. They do not seem to care about anything. <laughs> As they throw out the high From fives. the 22 minute mark, I believe. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, nice high five. Oh, that's pleasant. That's right. Oh. Give each other the high fives. There's the lift up. And he's, he's, they're going to leave him hanging. No, no oh, high five. No. Cookie trying to run away. Yeah, this is tough. And now Zephyr's like, please, high five, friends, hello. Yeah, there they go. Multiple high fives. Everybody's high fiving. What a clowny game. <laughs> what are they doing? <laughs> Why are they so silly? This was literally unforeseen, by the way. An yeah. Absolute shock. No, I'm joking. No, we can't be that, that, that ruthless to low key, but yeah. Geek fam just start again, like we said, just uh, on another level in terms of the SEA region. Yes. As the Impale comes out, Fly Solo going to be in the grave yet again. Teehee, he wants a kill, but White Mon going to hold on to him. Come over here oh, and say hi. Oh, where'd go, brother? Chase, chase. Fun times indeed as the Yule Scepter lift up is there. Timber Chain through, no. But the Impale will get the kill. The Zephyr claims his prize. Yeah. Right now, 2-1 and 21 on the Nyx Assassin, as GG's called. Gnarly. Hmm. Sure, that was a, that was a game of Dota 2. Um, 